morning guys happy show day um we are about to go get coffee and walk around central park it is well it's actually the girls last day in new york i'm staying another day or two i haven't decided but today is a show day very exciting i'm going downstairs to get a little snack just in case i just i'm not trusting where we're gonna end up getting coffee and then we're off and then i don't have to be at the venue until like two so i'm gonna come back here probably at like 12 30 and grab my stuff and then maybe i will get a lunch Time. We'll see. Yeah, because I don't have to be there till two. So, anyways, we're just staying in Soho, so it's like a little bit of a drive, but my hair looks interesting. So, anyways, if you guys are new, subscribe. Um, and welcome to the official show day vlog. It's sold out. Very exciting. Um, yeah, goodbye. Guys, Dom got robbed. Dom got robbed. Uh, it's so <laughs> fucked. Actually, oh my god, no. Like I literally got robbed on Juneteenth, you guys. You were supposed to pay for nothing don't, yesterday, and then you paid don't the- Don't go to the Kim's Bay AMC. Yeah, I was supposed to pay for nothing. Everything yeah. was supposed to be free for me. And then I lost some money. And here's the thing. So, I had cramps, passed out at my friend's bed. Woke up. And I was like, I'm wide awake actually. Like, we should go see a movie. Saw a late night movie. New Buzz Lightyear. It's a fantastic film. Film. Chris said, Walked out. Literally, not even like 10 minutes go by. I realized, I'm like, oh, shart. I left my wallet behind. So I turned back around, call him. Hey, I'm on the way. They're like, oh, yeah, we've located the wallet. Turn around. And I pull up, and the guy's like, here you go. I open it and I was like, oh, that's really shitty. There was cash in here. And he was like, oh, sorry about that. And literally turns back around and Beatrice starts kicking the door. <laughs> and we could have for sure gotten arrested. She's like, fuck you. <laughs> Kicking and screaming, telling them you're gonna steal them, take them off private, and they're worth all your worth. And then, and then our Uber arrives, so we go back. And they're and they're probably I'm like. I to dox them. I, got, I saw your story. Yeah, I dox them on Instagram, but then I made a TikTok being like, AMC, don't go to the Kips Bay AMC, and they took it down for harassment and bullying. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dom. No, I'll give you eleven no, dollars. No, it's so it's okay. It's the principle. Okay. It's the principle. If, 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 if last night she came in acting like she got beat up in the rock. She goes, Tess, I, I got robbed. I go, how? Like, did they take your wallet? She goes, they took my cash. I go, how much was in there? She goes, it was just, it was cash. Like, oh, like eleven freaking dollars. Eleven dollars. If any brand feels moved oh by God. what's happened to me. I have a donation fund in my bio. Check it out. She, the link in. she she doesn't have it yet, but I'll, I'll also have to set it up. But yeah, yeah great. Love this. Someone else will set up the GoFundMe. Love me. this. Yeah. yeah. No, I'm, I'm I'm gonna pass around my phone at the show today. <laughs> that's going in. That's 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 how I'm starting the show. I'll be like, guys, I got robbed last night. New York City starting to take things. <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna find a Miles Teller mm -hmm. look like, and instead, I got robbed. Lauren is having bad luck with the bikers today. Off to Blue Bottle we go. They have the New Orleans, like Spice New Orleans that's seasonal right now. So good, I had it yesterday. Wow, perfect. Okay, taste test. And does that really help you taste it? Pretty good, I'll give it. For some reason I was expecting it to be warm and talking to them, but <laughs> I don't know, nothing like Starbucks. Oh my god, you are literally insane. Mm -hmm. This is the spice Nola, so it's like not, honestly, it doesn't even taste like a Nola. It's like part chai. So it's really sweet. But we're at Central Park. You wanna see me do it again? Oh my god. Tess is like parkour. Well, imagine if you fell. <laughs> hey, try it again. You can do it. 
Wow, that good job. So She's bad. five, literally. <laughs> Oh wow! Oh, like Hagrid. <laughs> Do you have you even seen Harry Potter? Yeah, I grew up on Harry Potter. I've seen all well, of them. Like, I don't believe times. anything Kenzie says. Ask my mom. We went to all the premieres. That story that she tells everyone about Maddie, where she goes, "Kenzie, you don't like big dogs," in front of the whole theater, and humiliated me at five. And that's when our relationship went downhill. Thank you very much. Anyways, we're off to the show. Showtime yeah. in New York. Not Hermione. You, not me, not Hermione, you. <gasps> Did you see how she hit me the day after? Tortilla challenge. <laughs> That'd be a funny one. <laughs> but we like end up in a fight. Yeah, but I just, it's a brawl. <laughs> <laughs> Are you nervous? No, well now I don't want people to think I'm a bad person if I tell my story. No one's gonna think you're a bad person. There's I'm no not a bad person. <laughs> I'm not, actually. So but then say that you were. I didn't, yeah, no, I'm just reassuring myself. I'm not a bad person. Maybe not. Affirmations. No, you guys, I was robbed. And tonight I'm telling my story. Our friend said that she shouldn't tell that story in public. <laughs> but she's going to tell the story at live show tonight, so. And then she said. Did you tell her that you were telling Yeah. Her? She and said? she said, well, I'll be praying for you. <laughs> Have you ever had a. Look at what Hotel Drover gave me. Why didn't you take me? Um, I took my mom. Hmm. That's funny. All right, guys, walking into City Winery. All right, y'all, we made it to the green room. I have my outfit unfolded. My pants are gonna end up needing to be steamed. <gasps> Look who it is! So exciting. I'm um, getting my makeup done. This is the room, really just making ourselves at home. Bathroom in here, very green room. This is where I was for Claudia's like practice show for tour, so I've been here before, but not for myself. We're about to time Dom stand up sketch bit. Oh my gosh, hi! Oh, oh I didn't tell you to start. Start! Hi guys! Look who's here! How exciting! I'm so excited. I wish I had this on every Monday. I didn't have any Sundays scary yesterday. Really? It's like I had this yeah. Day. All right, guys, just got my hair done, makeup is done, I'm doing sound checks soon. I have a meet and greet in an hour. And then I have a lot of time in between that and meet and greet. I'll like yeah, an hour. Do. You did add it, by the way. I'm not even nervous yet. Because you're surrounded by love. Yeah. Well, at least, like, these people aren't going to hate me because they, like, had to buy a ticket to see me. Yeah, no, it's like you have yeah. nothing to worry about. Yeah. These are actually people. If you were in front of, like, group, like a group of people who didn't know who you were. Yeah. Like, yeah, then I'd be scared. Yeah. It is what it is. Dominique just steamed my pants for me. I did. So nice of her. <sighs> Someone's got to earn their keep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing my heels to sound check because I have to walk on this. What if, what, I want to wear these really photo shoots and stuff like that. You're giving them free foot footage. Okay, we have to go. Marco's on a call. Hannah Montana. No, Marco's not. Alright guys, we're out on stage. I mean, great is in like five minutes, yeah. but we're back here. It's gonna be great. How are you feeling? I'm feeling like completely fine. I'm like so calm, it's very odd. Completely fine. Yeah. I'll so. probably shoot my pants before. Eventually. <laughs> Okay guys, no, it's there really, 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 really has never been worse writing than ever. in this room. Are my heels over there? there I'm about to go out to the meet and greet. Um, VIP has arrived. And then I come back here and we have like an hour and a half until the show starts. Oh and that's when everyone's coming. I know, we're gonna be taking shots, so. Not more than one. No, not more than one, are you kidding? We but like I met three of us as I'm like, Dom is taking a shot. Like five ever. Yeah, so. she actually stopped drinking, apparently. She doesn't drink at all this weekend. Uh, love the makeup. Love the look, love the hair. I'm heading out now. Woo! 
All right, you now we have these cute little wine things that I've designed mm -hmm. from Tier Media. So cute. You know what's wardrobe things when you, me, and Margo are together? <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Nothing beat that time when like your a zipper was broken from. Oh my god, as coffee. teach coach. Yeah. You can't, oh I would not god, let the dress go. So. Yeah. Like Marco was like, just. Did we film that? There was a. I know that made it somewhere. Honestly. Yep. <laughs> it was the last photo of my photo. Um, Girls are here. Yeah. She's practicing her stand up bit again. She welcomed everyone to her show. <laughs> Spirit Airlines. Front two seats is considered first class. <laughs> Lauren has a surprise for you. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. <laughs> it looks great. I mean, it it looks really, really good. good. Yeah, you, you styled that better than anyone styled that. Really? Yeah. This is the worst shot. smelling tequila, tequila shot I've I think I've ever had. Wait, um, <laughs> wait, there's so many cameras. Okay. Alright, guys. Yay. Thanks, guys. Look Yay. Yay. This is actually my favorite song in the entire world. Boom! <laughs> This just came up on shuffle right this before we go on. It's a good sign. Like down rings and football team. I cannot believe this song came on. It's a sign. God is here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay, my heart is beating. Ahead of us, so without any further ado, oh. y'all, please put it together for your opener, Dom. attention that we it got. It was so fun. It was yeah. really fun. I know, I'm really sweating. Hello. Hello, hello. Hi. Hi. Oh my gosh, all of my friends. Jessica? Jessica? Jess? Jessica? 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 Did you finally, finally, I have been waiting years for this. Thank you so much. That is actually the most thoughtful gift anyone has ever gotten me. All right, we're going to dinner. We've got a big table talk. How's everyone feeling? Good. Amazing. We love and love you so much. So much. We love you. We love you so much. Thanks guys! Anyways, we're going to dinner now, guys. Margo was not kidding. Wow. Alright guys, we're now at our post dinner, our little show dinner. Hello, 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 our little plus one queen, our little fourth star of the show. We've moved to one table, this is giving wedding. This is giving wedding, we're all here. If you watch the last vlog, Lauren finished National Treasure today. Tonight, National Treasure 2, I watched every second of it. I don't care how exhausted you are. I have to leave at 8 a.m. I haven't started packing. Okay, 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 yeah. You were not watching the movie when you get home. No, she will make new full movie. Bullshit. Ryan loves me. Thank you so much, she killed it. You um, guys, yeah, you should be at the next one. There'll be more. You too. You could be at the next you one. You too. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Love the Okai bags. Always. Dom has hers with her. But I'm so tired. We just finished dinner. It was so much fun. I'm exhausted. You should have told us you had this up for sleep. Could have totally changed the show. Could have totally changed the show. Yeah. Go apart. Why did Don pop in? You can do this. <laughs> oh wow. Alright guys, we're back. Great sold out show. Guys, thank you so much for laughing. Don <laughs> got a lot of laughs tonight. Yeah, everyone told me I should go into stand-up. Yeah. What are you thinking? 
I'm going to stand up. Okay. Did it did it like make you feel alive? Yeah, maybe it set my soul on fire. Wow. Yeah, pastoring didn't work out, so this is a close <laughs> second. I was like, that is something that you got in ministry school. Yeah, really. It really did. A bitch has to be on stage somehow. Sorry. <laughs> oh, <laughs> It's so funny. Look at this yeah. shirt I got, Kenzie. Should I wear it tomorrow? Yeah. Don't mess with Texas women. Like, don't even fucking think about it. That's so cute. Isn't it so cute? And look at what I got, Tom. I think these gifts equal each other. I agree. Kenzie got me a Kindle! Because she was complaining that we don't have any hobbies that we share. I can't believe so you really got me a Kindle. Wow, well, she's rich. <laughs> <laughs> I've never looked at how much Kindle is. <laughs> <laughs> I like Kindles are not that expensive. Oh. <laughs> They're like a hundred bucks. bucks. <laughs> yeah. Well, when you when you have a squatter budget. I haven't had one of these since I was a kid. I used to have the big fucking... I had a nook when I was younger. Dude, I had the thicky one. The big... I didn't know that was the one that says turn page on it. Oh, that's what I have. That's the one that I had. That was ancient history. So, are you going to read Seven Husbands first? Yeah. Do your TikTok series? So, this is what I'm planning. I'm going to read this on the plane. Actually, I might have to pop dream I mean, I might be too sick. Um, But, Seven Husbands... Week one. Week two? It ends with us. No. Because the Crawdad Sings movie is coming out. So I need to read that. I hated that book. Oh. Then I need to read The Summer I Turned Pretty again because yeah. the show came out. I know. I think I need to reread that. I need to reread it. And then I will read, what's it called? It ends with us. It ends with us. Yeah. You need to read that before October because this second one comes out in October. Well, I'm reading a book a week. What? That's normal. That's what this bitch does. I do two or three. She's not. And, and, <laughs> yeah. And, and. I'm an overachiever in every area of my yeah, life. Yeah, exactly. You read two or three, I can read one. And that'd be that, good for you. What you need to do, it'll be good for your mental health. You need to read 20% a day. 20% a day, exactly. And I'm gonna be like this. And it, it's easier to read it in percentage than it is to flip the pages. I can't make it up. I, I don't know how to explain it, but it's easy. Wow. Okay, so show recap. How do you feel about it? It went really well. Kenzie is really funny. And you were the star of the show. No, but you were you're really funny and um you and Margot's show, like you guys just up there was perfect and really fucking hilarious. Like I was like in the green room like cackling. <laughs> but I was like scrolling on hinge, you know? Were you actually on hinge when you said that? <laughs> yes. Oh, I thought you were kidding. I, I didn't realize that you were really unhinged. I was. And I was literally scrolling through, and then she said something, and I was like, that! <laughs> like, I kept doing that, like, all, like, the whole time. I was like, nah! That was funny. Well, anyways, thanks so much to everyone who came. Guys, thank you so much. That was really cool. I would say something more sentimental. I'm just, like, really too tired. I'm really grateful. I can. Incredible. Love you guys so much. Guys, I love you so much, and that was really, really, really cool. And I think Kenzie and I should go on a world tour next. Yeah, I agree. Um, comment down below where you want to see us next. I'm thinking the coast of Italy for a live show. I don't think one person from the coast of Italy follows me. Yeah, I think so. Maybe you. This is fucking touch screen. Yeah. This is really nice, you guys. She got me like... <laughs> this is not any bullshit. Do you know how many times she's left my house without taking a Kindle? Guys, I'm literally like... Like, I'm literally going to be reading. Oh my gosh. I can't even, I can't even describe. I mean, where's my phone? What are you doing with your phone? I'm going to post that you bought me a, be like, Kenzie's, um, this is my present tonight. Even though I should have, I should have got you something a little more. No, I actually was going to get you a gift, but I'm a little behind on that one. So, uh, <laughs> that shirt was your, yeah. So that shirt was Kenzie's gift. Obviously, very equal in price. Thank you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. The show, parts of it are going to be available on YouTube and the podcast, um, like, next week. Actually, maybe by the time this vlog goes up. Oh, my gosh. You can watch it again. Well, I don't want to see that. I'm not going to watch it. I can't watch I it. I can't watch that. But, anyways, love you guys. Bye. In New York, concrete jungle where dreams are made of. There's nothing you can do. I know a lot of people are like, I don't want to be on dating apps. Okay, that's fine. My one advice if you don't want to be on dating apps is go to places where a future partner would be for you. So if you want to date somebody that's like into beer because you like breweries, then go hang out at breweries on the weekends. If you want to date somebody who likes books because you like to read, then go to bookstores.